creating success depends on a few things. The first one is every employee in the organization really needs to understand the purpose of their job. Why is this job being done? Uh, along with that, we need to really define what's the product or the products of the job, meaning what comes from it? What are we actually producing? From there, if we want to be successful, we need to come up with a plan that's going to track and measure that production. Right? So we need to be able to see actually what's being produced, have measures for it, track it, and then finally, we need to have a process in place that's going to properly reward that production. So I'm going to take up each one of these as the balance of the presentation here, and, and the goal being to help you look at how you could build a plan within your organization. And what I'm going to do is, I, is I'm going to take three different positions. So I'm going to take a service technician, I'm going to take a receptionist, and I'm going to take an accounts receivable or collections person and give you some real-world examples as to how this can apply in those two admin positions and that service position. And then create an incentive that says, here's where we are today. If you take it from here to this level, then you will be able to earn an incentive of X number of dollars. If you take it to this level, it's this much, and so on. So the idea being that we're, we're giving them a starting point, which is their current production. Here's where you are today. You improve it. You have the ability to make more. And when done that way, I can tell you again, we've seen by far the best results of any plans that we've done. 